Hi guys, in this experiment, I am going to talk about no load and blocked rotor test on 3 phase injection motor. The nameplate details are HP bar kilowatt is 5 kilowatt, voltage is 415 volt, current is 1.5 ampere, speed is 1500 rpm. The apparatus required for the experiment are voltmeter 600 volt, MI type quantity 1, and ammeter. 0 to 10 ampere MI type quantity 1 and watt meter 600 volt 10 ampere UPF quantity 2 and then watt meter 600 volt 10 ampere LPF quantity 2 and we need a 3 phase VDX 415 volt slash 0 to 450 volt quantity 1. The circuit diagram for this experiment is this one. Here we connect a 3 phase auto transformer, ammeter, watt meter and 2 watt meter. Here we give a 3 phase power supply. The procedure for no load test is with the auto transformer in the minimum position, the supply is switched on and the voltage is increased to a rated voltage. All the meter readings that is ammeter, voltmeter and the two wattmeter readings are noted down under this no load condition. The auto transformer is brought back to the minimum position and then the supply is switched off. During no load test, we don't apply any load here. The tabular column for no load test is this one. I am going to write down the value. 4.9 744 watt and then for a block to rotor test the procedure is with the auto transformer in the minimum position the rotor in the block to position the supply is switched on the voltage is increased and the ammeter reaches the rated current of the motor all the meter readings volt meter watt meter and then ammeter readings are noted down and then the auto transformer is brought back to the minimum position and then the supply is switched off. Here we apply load, so it is called a blocked rotor test. The tabular column for blocked rotor test is this one. I am going to write down the value. Voltage is 80, current is 7.5, watt meter is 1360. The formula used for this experiment is this one you can take a screenshot of this or uh, you can download the file I have given in the link given below just uh, see the formula used here with this formula we are going to draw uh, this circle diagram I will explain step by step how to draw this diagram I am going to write all this value. First, initially I am taking a I0. I0 is 4.9. I am approximately taking it as 5 ampere. Now I am going to calculate for cos theta. Cos theta not is equal to W0 that is 744 by root 3 into 415 into 5 equal to 0 0.1917 you can calculate this using calculator I'm just uh, writing the correct value taking this value cos inverse we can get the theta naught value theta naught equal to 78.94 degree and then for a short circuit the power factor is cos theta sc equal to 400 by 2, 3 into 40 7.5 0 0.3079 and then uh, ISCN I S C N 
17.96 ampere and then WSCN equal to 400 into 415 by whole square 689 watt. With this value, we are going to draw a graph. Take the face R reference voltage in Y axis. In Y axis. And then draw uh, x-axis